Hello everybody, welcome back to The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. So we found out who was in Uma's body and it was this guy over here, the um, the elder uh, sage, um, Avalok. Uh, and uh, now we have to gather our friends our, or allies uh, and then go look for, or and look for Siri. Uh, it's not and then, it's, you know, go look for Siri uh, or gather our allies or do both. Um, and we found out that Siri is in the Isle of Mist, which I believe, if I'm not mistaken here... Do, 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 no. One second. Isle of Mist... Geldas, uh, da, 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 da. I thought he said it, it was in Skellige. Didn't he say he was in Skellige? Go to Skellige. So I take it that's where the... Yeah, that's why I said it's in Skellige in the previous episode. Because, like, talk to your friends or go to Skellige. And, yeah. Okay, so let me just have a look here and see if anybody else wants to talk to us. Let's go. Hmm? Here we go. Happen on any interesting contracts lately? Yeah, not lately. But about half a year back, I slew a manticore in Creighton, in a forest. Quick son of a bitch, that one. Jumped out of the undergrowth so fast my medallion didn't have time to give me so much as one twitch. Won't show you the scar. Too big a boy for that. Get a nice sum at least? <laughs> Not one copper. Showed the beast's head to the elder in the nearest village. He swore on all the guys it was the first he'd heard of the monster. Great. What about you? Besides the griffin, same old, same old. Neckers, ghouls, drowners. Haven't seen a manticore in... Must be a year now. Okay, so nothing... See what ya. the f... Apparently when we're, cl when, when we're like close to this table, crap happens. Yes? Oh, you're... Are you okay? You seem to be almost recovered. Anyway, okay, let's see now. Uh, Lambert? Can we talk? What about... Never mind. You don't See have you anything to yeah, say. Care. Okay, uh, maybe Jennifer. Geralt. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um. Ever think about the past? About your time with the hunt? At times, I'm amazed we survived. Eridan's not usually one to leave witnesses behind. That's just it. He didn't. Lost my memory when I escaped the hunt. Ah, yes. Your famous amnesia. You didn't have it? For a short time only. Once the Emperor's mages got their hands on me, my memory quickly returned. Wow, okay, we can answer... We can, uh, sorry, talk about a lot of stuff here. Whoa, okay, okay, I'm gonna go into this because I'm curious. When the hunt had you... I hope they didn't hurt you. Even if they did, I've no memory of it. The whole time's but a string of phantom images. Blood and fire. A wild chase through different worlds. All shrouded in fog. Though I do remember you coming for me. Trading your life for mine. I hadn't the chance to thank you then. You'd have done the same for me. I'm touched by your certainty. <laughs> But you've yet to tell me how you escaped them. Wouldn't mind knowing that myself. There are times I remember rushing forward, red riders around me. Next thing I know, I'm in the woods at the foot of Kaer Morin. That's it. What did Aridin want from you exactly? The same thing he wanted from you. You don't recall? Draw a blank on most of my time with him. We were bait, Geralt. Both of us. Eridan believed Ciri would come for us sooner or later, and he would capture her. Fortunately, she didn't fall for it. How do you go from being the Emperor's hostage to being his ally? One day, the door of my cell opened, and instead of seeing the usual officer, I saw Emir. He promised to release me and grant me free reign of the Imperial Treasury, provided I did what he asked. He told you about Ciri, and you accepted his offer. Why? Shared aims make for strange bedfellows. 
I knew I had to find Ciri before Eridan did. And if any man had the power and the means to help me, it was the Emperor. Besides, once all said and done, he is her father. True. Okay. Why didn't you look for me after you'd recovered your memory and your freedom? I assumed you would recover quickly and find me first. You had mages to help you. I was on my own. Well, not entirely. Besides, I knew you'd fled the hunt. Eridan would never have let you go. He'd erased my memory, but you escaped. It was wholly possible he hadn't had the chance with you. And there were your Witcher mutations. I expected they'd stave off any serious injury. Okay. Still can't get something out of my mind. What? So, feel any different after our encounter with the Jinn? Yes. Now I feel... Regret. What? Mean to say that... That I regret we didn't try that earlier. Much Oh, earlier. I see. Think we would have argued less? Quite the opposite. But the other moments would have been more intense. Whoa, well. okay. Moments like this. <laughs> Found something that might be yours. Found something that might belong to you. That skull, some sort of accessory. If so, you changed oh, your style. Oh, I forgot right? about this. Weapon. Don't remember ever seeing you with that. It's as you said. I've changed my style. That's the raven skull that we found way hey, hey, back. Okay, Yen. Thanks, Yen. See you later. Whoa, nice one. Okay, guys. Let's go. It's time for us to go and talk to Emir Var Emris. I'm sure he's going to be delighted to find out that the Wild Hunt is truly after her, his daughter, and that uh, we need to fight them off. Yeah, it's it's like uh, it's like they say, winter is coming. <laughs> Come on. Whoop, up, 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 easy, does it. There we go. Is there anything else? There's there's a bunch of stuff that we haven't even looked. Oh, 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 oh. what is this? Berengar's notes. Handwriting looks familiar. Berengar's. Papers have been lying here for years. Whoa, damn hunk of metal. A week sweating with bellows and forge. And what do you know? There's Torhern shining in my hands, and then there it goes, cracking into shards with the first practice strike. Must have botched something in the alloy composition or cooled it too fast after forging. Hard to say. Just gotta try again, I guess, but not here, because Vesemir's already beggaring, badgering me with his blasted words of wisdom. Should have known asking his advice was opening a bottomless can of worms. Don't know how Geralt puts up with that without going the rest of the way crazy. Whoa! How about that? He was working on a sword. And not just any sword, judging by his notes. Toy. What is this here? Beren... Berengar's blade. How to talk to Vesemir. Berengar consulted him. Vesemir might remember how far he got. Wait a second. Wait a second. What do we have here? Is this some special sort of uh, sword? Sorry about this, guys. Sorry for going back and forth here, but uh, like we're here. Why? Why wouldn't we talk to to Vesemir? You know what I mean? Come on, Vesemir. Let's go. Damn it! I lost uh, precious precious time in there. Could have just ran up the stairs. Where are you, Vesemir? Eskel. This the catacan you had a contract Whoa. for? Hmm. A month of tracking, stalking. But I finally dropped the son of a bitch. Congratulations. Can't help wondering, though. Why'd you keep the corpse? Aim to stuff it, hang it above the mantle? Hmm. Not a bad idea. Gotta finish the autopsy what? first, What? The autopsy? This one was quicker than most. Quicker and stronger. 
Want to examine it thoroughly. Can I have a look? Mind if I have a look? Want to do the honors? No thanks. You cut. I'll grab a bite to eat. <clears throat> okay, this is new. So, let's examine uh, its head. Let's examine its head. Long whiskers. Protruding frontal lobe, but that's normal. Long ears. And an earring. That's new. Mm-hmm. Seen that before. Some of them like shiny objects. Like uh, bagpipes. Okay. And in the maw, yellow dull teeth. Missing its upper front teeth. Lower incisors. Clearly not a flosser. <clears throat> Fine, let's move on. Open its gut. Mm -mm -mm. So, anything interesting? Uh, bits of undigested food. A few decades worth, looks <laughs> oh, like. Oh, shit. Human hair, a belt buckle, a few coppers, and a gold ring. Want to give it to <clears throat> Yennefer? <laughs> Ought to be as good as new once you polish it a bit. No thanks. She only wears <laughs> silver. That's her loss. Rest is perfectly normal, except for its gnarled liver. Seems like I had a pension for the blood of drunkards. Okay then. Nice claws. Fifteen inches, I'd say. They grow its whole life. This one was about a hundred, hundred ten years old. Pretty muscular legs. Calves and feet especially. Let me tell you, this sucker was fast. One second here, there the next. Always in the shadows. Could barely see it. Not sure I'd have managed without the alchemist's help. Okay. Think I've seen enough for now. This was an old one. Experienced. Hmm. It'd be nice to figure out a way to determine a catacan's age based on its tracks. Avoid running across one like this unprepared. It would, I agree. But later. See you, Eskel. Okay, so is this going to lead to something, or we don't know yet? Vesemir. Yes? What is it, Wolf? I found uh, Berengar's notes. Found some of Berengar's notes. From what I made out, he was trying to forge a sword. Torhan, you were helping him. Advising, at best. Boy never managed to forge the blade, but would never let me at the anvil. Just pestered me with questions. Wanted to do it all by himself, as always. But then the whole plan went to the devil. Literally. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? Beringar set out to hunt a chort. The fiend had made its lair in the valley past the keep. Don't know why, but he took all his equipment with him. Maybe thought I'd tinker with his sword while he was gone. You know what he was like. At any rate, the chort turned out to be strong. The Too short. short. Berengar had to turn tail, and since it's hard to run with four stones of kit under your arm, he dropped it all. Came back red with blood. And shame. Hardly said a word, and left soon after, never to return. I know the rest of the story. How do I get to this chort's lair? <laughs> I knew you'd want to finish this. Easiest way is to take the river downstream, as far as you can go. But be careful. Berengar had his flaws, but he was a damn good fighter. If that chort's still there, you could be in for a wild... Or a wild hunt. Hey. <laughs> Head down to the river to the chort's... Wait a second, I'm not gonna go anywhere now. Is this where it is? Really? Berengar's blade is there. Okay. No, I'm not gonna go in there uh, now. We have other things to do. So, like I said, talk to Emir. Let's go. Let's do this. We're gonna talk to Emir, and then we have some other unfinished business in um, Velen and as, uh, also in Oxenfurt. Uh, so I'm thinking that maybe, maybe when we go to Velen, we do, we also do the remaining contracts that we have, and other remaining quests that we have. Just saying, just saying. Um, 
because it would be nice to, you know, do them if, um... If they're like our level, I, I don't want to leave them for when we're like too, you know, high of a level to do them. Uh, because, I don't know, maybe we can use the rewards and, yeah, why not, and the experience. Whoa. There we go. So, first things first, we go to the Royal Palace in Vizima. Why am I... What the hell is... Why am I overburdened? Why does... What the hell? Something is wrong here. It looks like I'm overburdened, but I'm not. More run. Do you find Durgoff? Oh, yes. He was talking to some friends of my father. Poor chaps can't get their minds off politics, not for an instant. I truly hope they'll allow themselves some respite after the coronation. Okay. Farewell. Um... Hail, Kerzer! Yeah. We, we also have some uh, finished quests. I believe we need to get some money out of somebody in uh, Novigrad, if I remember correctly. Uh, the guy with um, the black pearl, I think. And also, I think Hattori was, was crafting a sword for us. So, you know, we should, we should get that as well. Hello, Emir. Um, mind if I just look around for a second? Elder Folk Boots and Superior Northern Wind. Uh, why not? Why not? Okay, a bunch of books that maybe we can sell later because it seems that we kind of read everything there is to read the wild hunt we got some orans yeah that's good some good finds in um, in here whoop hope you don't mind him here Oh, we also have something in here, okay. The wild hunt. Some blueberries and a dumpling. More blueberries and a dumpling. Hello there. Your Imperial Majesty. Witcher, why have you come? I've managed to find out where Ciri is. Finally, I'd begun to doubt the wisdom of enlisting you. Bring her here at once. It's not going to be that easy. The wild hunt's pursuing her. Kermorin's the only place she'll be safe. That was not a suggestion. I can defend my own daughter. I'm gonna be... I, I, you know what? I'm gonna just try to play the cards right here if I can. I don't doubt it, but... I don't doubt it. Against conventional foes, the wild hunt's different. Facing it here would put Vizima at risk. Hundreds of innocents could die. Kaer Morhen is in a wilderness, and your army stands to be far more helpful there. Hmm. Agreed. I shall send a banner with you. On one condition. General Voris will Oh, it. really? Can't agree to that. And I cannot agree to witches commanding my troops. Well, I'm not about to give in. You don't look it either. Sorry to take up your time, your majesty. No way. Bring me city. I will, if that's what she wants. Are you freaking kidding me, man? He's not gonna help us? Oh, that's bad. Okay, I was actually hoping that he's gonna be like, yeah, 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 I'll give you the army or what, what I mean, he was... He was technically going to give us... 
Oh man, that's... Oh, that's gonna be rough. You no, 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 no. Whatever, I, I, truly hope I thought he would have something else to say. Farewell. Okay. Whoa, man, that's uh, harsh. That is harsh. Okay, we're going to go with the Brothers in Arms in Novigrad. In Novigrad? Okay, Novigrad. But... Wait just a second here. See, we have a bunch of contracts here, like Lord of the Wood, The Oxen for Drunk, Doors Slamming Shut, Missing Sun. This is in Skellige. Okay. Mysterious Tracks in Velen. Mystery of the Byways Murders, Beast of... Honorton, Honorton, why not? Why not do them? Why not do them, guys? Let's go. Let's do this. Follow the tracks using your Witcher senses. Let's do these contracts. Yes, Hen, as queen. Okay. So, in here, where is it? Where is the little uh, Linden Vale? There we go. I also want to do um, to get some. Um, it matter where the group's from? To get some um, uh, some upgrades to the gear, why not? What do we have here? What is this? Appeal to Sir Geralt of Rivia, the bridge, his crest. Uh, yeah, we're not going to go into that because I think that is um, that is actually uh, one of the DLCs. Okay, come on, Roach. Come on, let's go. Follow the tracks using your Witcher senses, huh? Whoa. Easy. What do we have here? Uh, can I just read a little bit? So, in the village of Lindenvale, Geralt came across a highly unusual contract. A certain hunter was worried by some strange tracks he found in the woods and sought someone who could help him determine to whom or to what they belonged. Okay, got it now. Um, Left a lot of fur when I rubbed against the, the trunk. What the hell? Scent's still there. Okay, let's follow the scent then. It's a pretty, pretty powerful scent. Ooh, 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 we got something over here. Is this like, uh, what is this? Stinks like fiend shit. Right. Hold him dried out. Fiend's fiend. been around a while. I don't think we've... Gotta find another way. Whoa, I don't think we've uh, ever fought a fiend before. This should be interesting. We need to get into that cave of some... So okay, so there's... Uh, yeah, this is like a cave of, or something, right? Let me see now. What is this here? I don't know. Up, 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 up. Am I close to... N no, I'm not. Because it's up there. Um, crap. Okay. Find a way into the cave. Maybe it's... What is that? It's not underwater, is it? No. Is it? No. Damn it. Okay. Come on, there has to be another entrance here, man. Whoa! Whoa! Here we go, here we go. Okay. Dropping down here. There's nothing in here, is there? Doesn't look like it. Explore the cave. Okay. Whoa. Died recently. What, what the hell? It.
Another trail. Tracks too small for a fiend. What though. can kill a fiend though? There's, there's blood over there, which we both lost loads okay. of blood. I thought we couldn't examine the blood. Come on. Paw prints. Fight lasted a while. Alright. Whoa, easy. Okay, what am I missing then? Oh, there's something here. There's something here. Wait a second. Tufts of blood caked fur. Second beast was a different color. Not short. It's gotta be. Probably competed for territory with a oh. fiend. Mm. Have to lure him here somehow. Okay. Oh. Howler. What the heck is a howler? Wait a second, guys. What the heck is a freaking howler? Uh, no. No. Howler, no. Spectres. Relics. Ooh, is it a relic? Howler. Yes, it is. Whoa. Oh, shit. One is hard-pressed to name another area of our world more thoroughly riddled with monsters than Velen. There is one silver lining to this sad fact, however. The beasts living there must compete fiercely, fierce, fiercely, yeah, for hunting territory, meaning monsters often end up killing other monsters. An aggressive chort uh, known as Howler went on just such a fruct Trishidal rampage, tearing a pack of wolves to shreds before attacking and killing a fiend significantly larger than itself. Oh crap. Howler was a truly fearsome foe. Each one of its of its blows was enough to kill. Only heavy armor or the, the quen sign could protect one from mortal damage, particularly to be avoided was its charge. And whenever possible, the monster was best attacked from the side. Ooh. Ho ho ho. Okay, Relic Oil and Devil's Puffball. Okay, good to know. Too bad the dung's not fresh, but it ought to still work for a lure. Oh yeah, great. Prepare some bait based on the alchemy formula. Seriously? We have an... Uh, okay, short lure. Yeah, let's do this. Now what? Pour the bait around the hill. Okay. Well, this should be fun. Um, when you say pour the bait, do you mean... The fuck is it? Okay, wh what the heck is it? No, seriously now. Um... This one. Do I need to put it like here? No. Um, I'm not very sure what the hell I'm supposed to do here. Honestly. Maybe I'm actually supposed to go... Okay, I'm going to go into the other locations and see if there's anything... Okay, I'm uh, seriously. Oh, okay, here we go. Like this. Okay, I think I'd prefer to. F Done. How to attract the choice okay. attention? I think I'd prefer to fight uh, there outside of the cave, not on top of this hill or um, down there where we first um, used the short lure. Let me see now. Okay, that's number two. Get ready for number three here. Like that. 
And uh, then... It'll smell this five <laughs> miles away. And uh, then, last but not least... Let's, uh, let's pour this over here. Yeah, I'd rather fight here because it's like a... Um, an open area. Beast's sure to show. Just gotta oh. win the cave. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> okay then, I guess I'll wait in the cave. Don't know why I thought it would be this easy <laughs> to fight wherever I want for a change. Okay. Wait in the cave. I'm in the cave. And... Holy shit. You're ugly. Come on. You're yes. ugly. Wait a second. Wait a second. What the hell was it again? It was... Fowler. It was Relic Toil. That's it. Uh, relic Toil. Sorry, give me a second, guys. Relic Toil. Whoa! Easy does it. See you, see you later, Wally Gator. Easy. Whoa! Come on. Holy moly. What the hell? What the hell is wrong with your foot, man? Okay. Didn't put up quite the fight. Azure Wrath and a short trophy. Hmm. That's right, because we have never fought a short before. And the short, which we already uh, equipped here, 5% bonus experience from monsters. What did we used to have? We used to have this, oh, humans and non-humans. And then experience from monsters, humans and non-humans. Hmm, okay. Humans and non-humans sounds more like humans and monsters to me. Right? Am I right? Hope I'm right. Okay. Cool. We killed the short, guys. Let's get our... Uh, there we go. Let's get our money. Money's worth. Um, is it far away? It shouldn't be far away. No, it's not. Come on. Come on, Roach. Roach? Get over here, girl. Okay. So, let's see here. I'm gonna have a look at what other contracts we have un unfinished and uh, we'll do that. Oh, I. Hello there. Uh, about the contract. The Chort was prowling the nearby forest, found itself competing for territory with a fiend, so it turned aggressive. A Chort? Fiend? Why they be bothering us? Think more'll come? Think they've done made a pact to take what? our village? Doubt it, but I'll be sure to keep my eyes open, see if there's anything else out there. Cheers then, Witcher! Here, take the purse. All the folk of the village Okay. In. Thanks. Take care now. Alright, we got it. Um, we got some uh, some nice experience points from uh, from all that and good money. Did we speak to you before? What? Ah, uh, yes, we did. 
Are you offering anything interesting? Got anything interesting? <laughs> no. What is this here? Elven Whetstone. Woo. Haven't seen that before, to be honest. And that's it. Okay. <laughs> okay, let me let me have a look here really quickly. Uh, with your contracts in Velen. So, Mystery of the Bywater Murders. Talk to the commander of the Nilfgaardian patrol. And then we also have the Beast of Honorton. Uh, anything else? No, these are the two contracts that we have in Velen. So, let's see here. This one, is it very far away? Shouldn't be that far away, should it now? Or should it now? Okay, it's it's in Oriton. All right, and okay, cool. One second though. Is there a blacksmith over here? Yes, it, there is a blacksmith over here. Just just want to check one thing before we we head out to do this contract. Sent my youngins to pick mushrooms yesterday. To the woods. No. Come on. The blacksmith. Trusty arms for all sorts. Steel swords and strong maces for the menfolk. And grave knuckle dusters for the ladies. Mm -hmm. Can I see what you got in stock here? Because I'm thinking... Uh, no. Damn it. I was hoping he would have some maps for us. But he doesn't. Okay. Um, yeah. Okie dokie. Well, guys, so I'm gonna cut this episode here and we'll continue with the two contracts that we st Oy, still have. Um, and Let then wait. we'll uh, take it from there. Like, uh, like you, you've seen, we, we need to talk to, um, we need to talk to Dijkstra, Roach, and Zoltan. Um, and with Dijkstra and Roach, wait a second here, with Dijkstra and Roach, I thought we had... We also need to do this of uh, dumplings and uh, of swords and dumplings. High stakes. Talk to no, 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 no. The soldiers, no. Master of the no. I thought we had some unfinished business with Dijkstra and Roach uh, and uh, about Radovid. We'll see. We'll see when we talk to them, guys. Uh, like I said, for for the moment, I will leave you with this uh, beautiful uh, sunset. And uh, we'll continue on in the next episode. Thank you for watching. And as always, I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.